We'd be stood here four years later. Yeah, four years later. Mad, isn't it? Funny how it all works out, isn't it? Punching so far above me, won't you? <laughs> <laughs> as a symbol of my love and faithfulness and as a token of the commitment we have made here today. Oliver, I give you this ring as a symbol of my love and faithfulness and as a token of the commitment we have made here today. Oliver and Hannah, you have both made pledges and solemn promises to each other in the presence of your family and friends here today and confirm your marriage in a time on a tradition. Oliver and Hannah, you are indeed husband and wife and you may now kiss your bride. <laughs> Many congratulations. Good afternoon everyone, I'm Steve, Hannah's dad, and on behalf of my wife Catherine, Carol and Nigel, Oliver's parents, and myself, would like to welcome you all here today on this very special occasion at this amazing venue. There are some family members, sadly, who are no longer with us, but I know how they would be so happy for you both, and I know Nana would have loved seeing you, Hannah, looking so beautiful in your wedding dress. Don't set me off. <laughs> <laughs> well, Hannah, from the day you came into this world, you made your mum and me two very happy and proud parents. And it has been a pleasure and a privilege watching you grow into 
the beautiful young woman you are today. Where on earth do you start with a wedding speech designed by bleeding clean? <laughs> um, I, I firstly wasn't expecting to be in this situation, I must admit, but I am, so we are where we are anyway. So I just want to say thank you all very much for turning up. It's amazing what a bit of free grub and a bit of free food does. <laughs> My family, my mum, my dad, and my mum. People say that they have the best parents. My mum the best. My mum the best. I think, I think actually me and my sister are a lot more fun when we got really let on. Um, and yeah, we both predicted to run it. Mum and dad. Those events where they took you to the, uh, took you to the football, mum was stood there with a, a bag thinking I was going to make it on the football pitch. <laughs> Literally from about 10 to about 16, she was stood there running on the shrine with the medikit and everything. <laughs> you know, oh, bloody useless. You know, right? <laughs> but anyway, I didn't make it, I'm stood here now, and yeah, thanks a lot. Dad, you are the best, you're the best parents I could ever wish for. to the best looking lady in the room. What a lovely, lovely girl. She's the most caringest, friendliest person you will ever meet. She's the most gorgeous, go gorgeous, <laughs> gorgeous person, gorgeous bride I could ever wish for. And well, without Hannah, today physically would not be possible. <laughs> a lot of this room is a surprise to me. <laughs> Um, and Hannah has literally organised everything. Even down to the resin cards you've got on your tables, Hannah made them with her own bare hands. <laughs> well done. So all I want to do now is raise a big, big glass to my gorgeous bride. I'd like to all just stand. One last thing before we do that. It has been a terrible time with Covid. We're all here today. Thank you so much for turning up. Let's go and get pissed tonight. <laughs> yeah.